In this lesson, I'm going to show you how to play the song First Things First by Consumed by Fire. And this was requested by one of my subscribers and patrons, Andrew. So thank you for subscribing to the channel. Thank you for being a patron. Um, so this song, it's in the key of C. I think the easiest way for us to, to play this song would be to go capo on the fifth fret and play these G shapes. Um, that way, instead of playing C shapes down here with just, you know, no capo, when you play up here on the fifth fret, this will allow you to move the capo around a little bit if you want to kind of lead it and, and sing it and you just have like your, your range and your singing is different. Uh, then the original recording so you can slide it down to the third fret You can slide it down to the second fret and just play these same chords that I'm about to show you. So uh, For this song we need the G chord We need the C chord We need the uh, D chord do this D or if you wanted to add that D major definitely do that uh, we need the E minor chord and then the last chord we need for this song is a B minor so just in this E minor position bring this middle finger down one string and that's your B minor for the song so for this song, I'm going to go through the first verse um, and the second verse and the pre-chorus with some finger picking. It's kind of nice and um, light and like, you know, soft the first maybe quarter of the song. So I'm going to do some finger picking. Um, and then for the chorus in verse three and the rest of the song, I'm going to show you a strum pattern that you can use for this song. So uh, if you do need the chord charts, um, I have the chord chart for this on my Patreon page, which I'll link in the description down below. Um, you can print it off, you can download it. If you wanna print it off and just write some arrows and write some ups and downs for the strumming, whatever you wanna do, um, you can definitely do that. So the chord chart um, is what I'll be referencing on this video here. So for the intro, you're just gonna play the G chord. You can, so look, we'll start off just by, by doing verse one with the finger picking. So let me play through verse one with the finger picking pattern I'm gonna show you, and then we'll kind of get into it a little bit more. And all the things that I have held, dear vanities that whispered in my ear, what would I do if they all disappeared? So it's really a, a, a kind of a simple picking pattern. You don't need to do anything like snazzy for this. You're just kind of carrying a little bit of, you know, just, just rhythm in, in that picking pattern. So I'm in just the finger picking position over here on the right hand side. Um, I've done a bunch of lessons on finger picking, um, the easiest way to finger pick. I'll link some of those lessons that I do in the description and also um, up in the cards here in the top. But really just for Cliff Notes version, I've got my thumb assigned to these top three strings depending on the bass note of the chord. And then my pointer finger is locked into that G string. You can also, you know, to, to pluck it. I've got my middle finger locked into that B string to pluck. And then I've got my ring finger and my pinky finger kind of just, you know, um, securing and stabilizing my picking position here on this high E string. And I can also use my ring finger to pluck that high E string as well. So for this pattern, I'm just, you can do any pattern you want, but if you need help on um, just one to use to get you started, you could try this. All the things that I have held dear, the vanities that whispered in my ear. What would I do if they all disappeared? 
disappear Riches and fame and all that they could buy Have come to find and never satisfy What would I gain if my soul's the prize? Now we'll get into that pre-chorus. So really all I'm doing for that verse one and verse two is just thumb, pointer, middle, pointer. Thumb, pointer, middle, pointer. So you can, if you just needed somewhere to start that, that would be a good starting point if you wanted to pluck them together. And all the things that I have held dear, the vanities that whispered in my ear. You could also do that. So that just gives you a little idea. And then for that pre-chorus, we're gonna keep that same picking pattern. And I don't wanna know what the world does. And I don't wanna chase what the world does. I only want you, I only want you, first things first. So then we'll get into that chorus with, with kind of the strumming. Um, so that's what I would probably do um, if you wanted to just, you know, lead it or play along with the song. Do, do a simple picking pattern like that. Um, and then for the chorus, so our strumming. Um, we can just do down, down, up, down, up, down, down. So down, down, up, down, up, down, down. Down, down, up, down, up, down, down. And I always say when you're doing these strum patterns, if you wanted to add an extra down, up after that, after that pattern, just in between chords, it kind of just makes it a little bit more full and a little bit more rhythmic. So that would be down down up down up down 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 up down down up down up down 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 up so for the chorus this is what it would sound like first things first i seek your will not my own surrender all my wants to you to keep the first your truth, walk your ways, set my eyes, Lord I fix my face on you, all my desires reversed, to keep the first things first. So if we want to do a, just that simple strum pattern without the down up at the end, it would that chorus would sound like this. First things first, I seek your will, not my own. Surrender all my wants to you, to keep the first things first. To live your truth, walk your ways, set my eyes. Lord, I fix my face on my desires reverse to keep the first things first all right so if we're going into verse three with that strum pattern i'm just going to play through it and maybe hum through it um the lyrics kind of really flow um like together so be careful if you are singing and leading this song just make sure you know when the the lyric changes and just um yeah so verse three, I give it all, do, 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 have your way in me, do, 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 let's play through it again. That'll go right into the pre-chorus. I don't want to love what the world does. I don't want to chase what the world 
does I only want you I only want you First things first So for this song there's no there's no bridge um, there's just two choruses um, that are pretty similar but they're just they're slightly different uh, with their tags at the end of the chorus so I'm just gonna play through the um, the the first chorus and then the second chorus to end the song and you'll just I'll have the lyrics and the in the chord charts up on the screen so you'll be able to follow along and again we can just do this same strum pattern the Also add in that down up so for this first chorus it'll sound like this first things first I seek your will not my own surrender all my wants to you to keep the first things first to live your truth walk your desires reversed to keep the first things first to keep the first things first all my desires reversed to keep the first again of course too first things first I seek your will not my own surrender all my wants to you to keep the first things first to live your truth walk your ways set my eyes Lord I'll fix my desires reversed to keep the first things first to keep the first things first to keep the first things first all my desires Keep the first things first. So you definitely just want to pay attention and take note to some of those tags at the end. Um, and again, like if you if you need the core charts to print them off and really kind of draw some arrows and just draw some ups and downs and whatever strum pattern you're doing, um, you can definitely print those off, uh, download the PDF on my Patreon page. So. Um, I hope that helps you out. If you have any questions, definitely leave a comment down below um, and let me know. If not, I'll see you in the next one. Love you. Bye.